Okay, you guys are going to think this is funny, but young and old, I am doing the same video, the same devotional for our adults as I am for our kids for the same, the same uh, period of time. Our kids are working on self-control and kids, our adults are working on self-control. And we should all be working on self-control at the same time, all the time, not just for the month of January when we've been talking about self-control at First Kids and when as adults, we've been talking about what a great series uh, the self-control is for adults and kids alike, but we should be working on self-control all the time. So there is... Um, and by the way, adults, if you have not watched the first kids series for this month, for the month of January, go back and watch that. You can find the first kids links for the YouTube links for the series. You can find it on our Facebook page. Uh, sorry, not our Facebook page, our um, website page, fumcubacity.com. And uh, kids, you guys already know what a great program it has been through the whole month. So self-control and on this last uh, week of the series on self-control, one of the topics was taught or is talking about eating something to the point where you are just so full, you're almost sick. And as I was reading that for you kids, I was thinking us adults do the same thing. So it wasn't that long ago when we finished uh, the holidays and I thought about my background being a bunch of food on the table, but I chose a better one instead. Um, one that probably makes us feel better. So I don't know what your favorite food is, whether you're an adult or you're a kid, you have a favorite food. So for me, I have more than one favorite. I love macaroni and cheese, but I also love brownies and I can get absolutely sick on either one. The other thing I love is frozen yogurt with uh, maybe some chocolate chips or M&Ms in it. Oh my goodness. I can also get sick on that. I think that if we eat too much of one thing or anything, we can get sick and that's for adults and for kids. Now, what does that have to do with self-control? Yeah, you know, for all of us, we can have self-control for not eating too much food. Too much of a good thing isn't always a good thing. All right, so I'm gonna take you to Proverbs and Proverbs uh, 25 verse 16 says, if you find honey, eat just enough. If you eat too much of it, you will throw up. So it's even in scripture, don't eat too much of something, it will make you sick. Okay, now I'm going to go to the next step of this. What does this have to do with anything? Again, I think this is good for adults and for kids. So kids, when you guys are playing your video games, I'm sure they're a lot of fun. I know that my kids have a great time with um, doing video games. And I'm sure that you want to play it a lot and all the time. And if you're into video games, you want to do it all the time. Now, if you're a teenager or if you're an adult, we have phones that the same thing or social media the same thing too much of a good thing is too much too much of video games is too much too much of being on the cell phone is too much too much of being on social media is yeah you got it too much because what happens is it deprives us of time with being with our families, with our friends, being with God, reading scripture. Have you ever been playing a video game or on social media and um, before you know it, like hours have passed by and where did it go? And then you don't have the time that you could have had spending time with friends or family or reading scripture or going to church or watching first kids. 
So I want to challenge you guys this week, young, old, and all of us in between. What is it that you need to exercise self-control with? Because a little bit's good, but too much is just too much and gets in the way of doing other things that are healthy. Other things like spending time with family and friends and spending time in God's word. So I want to say thank you to the kids for sharing their first kids series with us. And for adults, again, if you haven't seen the first kids series, you really want to check it out for this month. And I happen to think that a lot of the months, it's really good for us as adults too. See you all next time. Take care.